Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Who decides who runs for president? The process of deciding who runs for president in the United States is multifaceted. It starts with individuals declaring their candidacy. This can happen years before the election. And candidates typically belong to one of the major political parties, like the Democratic or Republican Party. Each party has its own process for selecting a nominee. The primary elections and caucuses are crucial in this process. These are held in each state and territory. Voters in these primaries and caucuses choose their preferred candidate. The results of these primaries and caucuses determine how many delegates each candidate receives. Delegates are party members who represent their state at the national conventions. The national conventions are where the final decision is made. Delegates cast their votes for the candidate they support. The candidate with the majority of delegate votes wins the nomination. And however, there are also independent candidates. They do not belong to a major party. They must gather signatures to get on the ballot in each state. The Federal Election Commission, FEC, oversees the election process. They ensure that all candidates follow campaign finance laws. And ultimately, the decision of who runs for president involves multiple steps and many people. From voters to delegates, each plays a crucial role in the process. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.